All right, we're back in the shop. Uh, we're back from our little trip. Went up to uh, North Carolina for the, what do they call it, Moonshine Valley all Ford truck F100 show. Turns out it was a truck show, a Mustang show, and an open car show. Uh, I've got two videos posted, one for the truck show, one for the Mustang show. I've still got stuff to go through for the open car show. So whenever I get to it, and I'll be posting that. Uh, we back out here, gonna work on the Capri some more. As you can tell behind me, the door panels are not there. Uh, I had a little bit of time before we left to work on the door panels. Didn't didn't video any of it. Um, I didn't have a lot of time. So I mainly focused on just trying to get as much done as I could. They're actually in the car right now. There's still a few things that need to be tweaked, but we're getting there. I've also been working on a kind of a personal project uh, where I work. I normally paint my weld hood, do some kind of crazy design or something on it. Thought it was about time for a new design, new hood. So I've been doing a new hood. So this is the shot of the driver's side door panel. Uh, as you can see, it's in the car. I have to go back on this back side over here, touch some stuff up. Uh, part of my problem was when I made my template, I actually cut it a little bit too big. So it was hitting down there toward the bottom of the door. Also up here up front, right in there somewhere. Uh, it's still sticking out a little bit too much. We're going to, have to cut that down some, but made a lot of progress on them. And this is the shot of the passenger side. It was also hitting down toward the bottom of the door and the front up there. I've also got to trim it some, but for the most part, they fit up very well. Up here on the door handle, it is unfinished I've got to come up with some way of mounting the door handle right there due to the way the door handle mounted in the factory door panels that's why that's not finished but we're gonna figure that out later we're gonna make sure these things fit good and uh, go from there so I got the door panel trimmed down uh, I ended up having to cut all along this edge around that corner and uh i actually had to replace all the glass work that was down in here i was still hitting should be clear now um i haven't finalized any of the sanding on that i also had to trim some more back here had to rebuild this corner we're about to go do a test fit and make sure nothing's hitting. Uh, of course, I still got to clean out the speaker rings from where the Rondo ran off in them. Uh, it's going to be a little bit of a pain to do that, but I'm not too concerned with that. I've got to get this door panel to fit right. Uh, if this thing fits up good, clears everything, we're going to jump on the driver's side and start making sure it fits, doesn't hit anything, and everything clears. Uh, it fits. Uh, it's not hitting anything anymore. It is tight, but it does fit. Um, there's still a good bit of finish work I need to do to this door panel, but it fits now. So we're going to jump on the driver's side door panel. I've already looked at it and I know what i got to do. Um, we're going to get it trimmed up, get it fitting good, and then we'll worry about the uh, finishing work later. Um, like I said, I still got to fix the door handle. I got to figure out how I'm going to mount it up front. Due to, like I said, due to the way that it mounts in the factory door panel. And I um, also got to figure out the linkage going from the door handle to the door. 
But we're gonna hold off on that. We're gonna jump on that other door panel, get it took care of, get it fitting good. And then, honestly, we might go ahead and start working on the back door panels. That way, we can get the majority of this stuff done and it'll just be the, the fine tuning of things, so to speak, all the little uh, details. So I'm gonna jump on this door panel. We're gonna go from there. All right, we got a driver's side door panel trimmed down. I actually had to trim that whole edge. I had to go back fiberglass back around that corner. And I also had to trim some back here on the back side. It's all glass back together. Uh, this one's the same as the pasture side. Still got a lot of finish work. And I had to notch it a little bit right here. Just like the other one. Um, had a little hole, so I had to go back over that. We'll clean that up in a little bit. I want to make sure it fits good. If it fits good, we will be able to start doing finishing work on these. Um, I went and bought a little rotary tool to get all this out. Where all the Rondo ran down in the speaker ring. I know it's a mess. But we're going to take care of it. We're going to get it cleaned up, looking good. I uh, started cleaning out the holes, the uh, speaker rings with the little rotary tool. Works fantastic. Uh, kind of time consuming, but it's going to do the job, get everything done right. So we're going to keep on keeping on with it. Um, I'm out of time, so unfortunately I didn't get to finish it. But next week, depending on time, I'm um, going to have a lot of things going on next week. I'm going to try and get this finished up, get the uh, other door panel, get all those speaker rings cleaned out. I may start on the back door panels. I'm not sure yet. Uh, the owner of the car bought a truck, and the back bumper needs to be painted. So depending on how much time I have next week, he's probably going to be bringing me that. Uh, I'll have a couple days to do it. Should be no problem. Uh, I think there's like one dent in the bumper. Nothing crazy, mainly just uh, scratched up, paint's chipped. So possibly going to be doing that next week. I'm also in the process of painting another weld hood. It's a little different than the other one. Still got a lot of work left to do on it. I've been working on this just a little bit at a time whenever I'm waiting on fiberglass or anything to dry. Uh, still done up in the old Ed Roth monster style. So we may finish that up next week. And this is just a personal project of mine. It's, it's not for anybody. It's just for decoration. But uh, depending on time, maybe working on that some more. I also received a phone call from someone I did a sign for a while back. Did some lettering on it. Um, He's got another sign. He's wanting me to do a mural of his truck on. So I'm not sure when he's going to bring me the stuff to do it, but I've got to make a template and draw it out and everything. It's going to be pretty good size. I think he said the sign's uh, three foot by three foot. So it's going to be a pretty big job uh, whenever I do it. Of course, it'll be on here. But that's going to be all I got. Um, if you like the video, like the build, like seeing me paint crazy stuff, um, consider subscribing. Uh, drop me a like, drop me a comment, let me know what you think. We'll see y'all next time.